sounds so Breakfast Club 1996. I hate it. I'm leaving. Sorry. <laughs> Shout out to the two people that are watching. You guys are my two new best friends. <laughs> I was just asked what Trich was. Oh, you can see all my text messages. Maybe I should disable that. I don't know how. Oh, <laughs> so, you know, if you see anything weird come through, sorry. So, a little bit about me, which probably the two people that are watching already know who I am. My name's Kiana, and I am quite the nerd. Um, also, don't know if you can hear me. Let's see. Okay. Okay. I'm pretty sure you can now. I can hear myself. So, um, yeah. I've been playing Sims since like 20... 20... Probably 2006. It's like 2006. Yeah, I was in sixth grade. And I'm probably hella loud. Um, but yeah, just, oh, <laughs> hi Kay, I'm sure you're watching. You can type in the chat if you're watching or not. She asked me if Twitch was a new thing because she is somebody's grandmother. Um, but yeah, I've been playing Sims for a long time and been watching sims watch a whole ton of just like old you know dusty games and decided you know let's make a black one if one person watches or if one million people watch then we're gonna get you know we're still gonna have fun but yeah the whole purpose behind this is and there's really like no purpose it's just kind of fun playing around i don't see a lot of black sims get played with um i watch a ton of I watch a ton of YouTubers in general. Um, and like the white ones are cool, you know, white Sim YouTubers are cool, but they don't really play with a lot of black Sims. Um, so shout out to all the black Simmers that play and enjoy the game. Kind of just wanted to join in there and play around. Um, so we'll start with this one Sim whose name I do not know um, yet. I have not uh, decided, but yeah, we'll start off with this one Sim and we'll see how many generations of people we can get out of her um be able to like trace the lineage back i don't know how long this will run but we'll just start with her and her whatever amount of money we'll buy some land and then we'll build from there uh i don't have a backstory for her so you know i'm looking in the chat that is full of nothing but you know eventually there will be a backstory and we'll just play from there uh to answer Kay's question yes <laughs> people just watch me play like a bunch of nerds um, the three people that are in here just watch people <laughs> like a bunch of nerds but feel free to like comment and like ask questions and you know say general foolishness it doesn't matter um yeah we'll keep it moving from there I don't know I don't want to like bore people with my <laughs> with my constant rambling um so yeah I'm just gonna create and we're gonna have fun or maybe I'll just have fun and you guys will eventually drop off and decide you don't want to watch anymore. That's probably your decision. the skin tone so all the ones with the little wrench around them those are those are things that I've downloaded those are custom, custom content if you want to make a black sim in the sims 4 they gonna either look like this which is hella ashy and it just gets ashier from there like there's no such thing as undertones to the people that make the sims this is probably as much of an undertone as you're gonna get and 
from there, it just continues to get ashy. And for some reason, you can make blue people and you can make green people and red people and whatever color this is, people. But if you just want to make a black sim, they're going to look ashy and dead. And so a lot of us have to download custom content to just make sure that our sims even look like people. I get the custom stuff from a ton of places. Um, shout out to X Mira Mira. So X M I R A M I R A. She makes a ton of custom content. She's the one I believe who came up with the, the skins, like the custom skin tones. Um, there's also Kiko Vanity, who I will, let me see, I'll show you. Kiko Vanity, I believe, was the one who has these really nice um, body uh, changing mods, but it's a little easier to see um, when they're in swimsuit mode. So like, she'll base them off popular people. I think this is Ari, um, what's that young man's name? That's not like somebody's IT. It's not. I don't even know who it is. Um, G Herbo, that's his name. It's based off his baby mama, Ari. So like you get more voluptuousness. Um, and uh, I don't know who this one's based off. I think it might be Sweetie, but maybe not Sweetie. Um, and then a couple more. This is off of Bernice Burgos, I believe. Um, it could get a little glitchy, but it's overall better than what may be available in game. right now I'm just starting with one sim um, and then from this one sim we'll see how many different generations of sims that we can spawn and we'll also start with the little bit of money that they give and we'll see how much we can build from that honestly it'll um it'll probably be really shabby to begin with because the sims doesn't give a lot of money but everything in the game costs a lot of money um, but we'll see how far we can get with that and then also from time to time I'll probably pop in and the EA lots, again, something that is not racism related, but EA related that I'm not a huge fan of, is that when they start to build these lots, they quite literally just pick random stuff out of the, uh, the catalog and then just like throw it into these houses and it's bad. So, you know, occasionally I'll probably pop on here to stream and, uh, you know, do a little flip or flop. I love HGTV, so this is my opportunity to, you know, be one of those people that you know flip a house and make this EA world look a little, a little better. When we get in game, you'll see that it's, it's not, it's not great. Um, but right now we're just trying to be okay. I have two. That's up to you to decide. Um, that's all about preference, so.
probably. There's oh no no no. It might say Ebony, so E B O N I X Sims, who is another she's an EA game trainer, she's super cool. Um we don't know each other, so like I'm not saying she's cool from experience. I, I don't know her. Um but from what I've seen, um she's super cool and she's also a custom content creator. Um, that cares a lot about, you know, black sims and black simmers and our ability to enjoy a, a fun um, simming experience. So maybe, you know, let's see some other black um, on YouTube. You can follow. It's me. I think her name is Troy or Twa Alba. I'm not saying her name wrong. It's but you spell it T-R-O-I. She's really good. Um, Ocean Sims. But yeah, you can follow Ocean Sims. She's a pretty dope content creator. Um, Kia, which is K-E-E-Y-U-H. She has some really fun let's plays. And she plays, uh, I don't know, other stuff. I, think she, I know she plays Grand Theft Auto 3 in, on occasion. Um, she doesn't just stream Sims, but she does play Sims. Cherish Kenny. Yeah, shout out to that Cherish. I wonder, you know, actually I do know what happened to that Cherish. Um, the twins, I think, are making music together. And then the other two was like, nah, we good. And so I'm pretty sure what that's what happened to that Cherish. I don't know, I could be making it up. But I'm pretty sure that's what happened to that Cherish. Um, so I feel like a little bit of her backstory, let me back to a suitable outfit a little bit of cherish kenny's backstory is um she is a person that loves food and so she's a chef right and as a chef her only she's not really thinking about her lineage right now her only goal is to reach the top of the chef profession and open her own restaurant so that's where we'll follow cherish for now so Cherish is cool with a little relationship, but she's not really interested in marriage. So we'll see how a non-committal sim starts a generation of sims after her. But just as a quick lay of the land, this is her rinky dink apartment, um, linoleum on the tile. Um, I hate this, it's awful. But Cherish, she's about to try to make it her own. She's in San Machino from a very small southern town. And she's about to, um, you know, take the world by storm. So shout out to Cherish. Before we get out of here, let's get Cherish a job. Um, because you cannot start a lineage without a job. So we're about to get her a job in, uh, in the culinary profession. And then we're about to get out of here. Thanks for the three people that watched and the three people that uh, said words in the chat. That was three more people than I expected. Even if I know all three of y'all, I don't care. You know, it's still three more people than I expected. This is probably gonna be on YouTube later too when I edit it all together. Um, if I can, I don't know. I probably did something wrong. But if it is on YouTube, my YouTube is the same as my Twitch name, which is Sam Noir, which probably won't even exist. Cause that sounds very art ho in me anyway. Um, so <laughs> yeah, but for right now, the YouTube is Sim Noir. This will probably be up there uh, tomorrow or Sunday or something. And then yeah, I don't know how often I'm gonna stream because I got a real job outside of this. And you know, sometimes they be wanting that stuff on time and I can't really be mad at them cause I too would want my work on time if I was paying somebody. So we gonna say for right now, 
Fridays and or Saturdays at three o'clock. We gonna follow Cherish around and see what Cherish gets into. This is it. My name's Kiana. This is probably the most hectic uh, stream you've ever been to. And I'm out. <laughs>